solving the problem of duplicate security id sid the error message the name of the security id sid of the domain is inconsistent with the trust information for that domain by sachin sami powered by tech.pdcrisis.com okay first we will see what error it is showing we type the id user id and the password and let's connect to our domain peter kreis click okay as you can see it is showing an error the name of the security id the same error which was referred before now let's click okay and log on to this local machine as locally i have selected the local computer and i will type administrator and i will put the password and then i will log on okay click okay okay now i have logged on to a machine locally now first remove the machine from a member of the domain to remove the machine now make the work group member of the work group click okay once the machine is removed from the domain restart the machine once the machine is turned on log on as an administrator once the machine is logged on insert the cd of windows server 2003 in your computer after inserting the cd of windows server 2003 go to my computer open the cd minimize click on support folder tools deploy dot cap and copy all the all the files into the on the desktop after copying all the files close the cd drive and click on sysprep that is s y s p r e p open it click okay select the first option that will be do not reset the grace period of the for this activation select the first option factory now the system preparation tool is preparing a system it will be automatically restart now it is shutting down after the machine is shuts shuts down you have to restart the machine after restarting login as an administrator after logging in close the system preparation tool and delete the files which we copied after deleting the files go to my network places properties local area network properties and check the ip address if there is no ip address you have to put the ip address click okay and close
disable the extra land cards close this after that go to start run and ping the server type the server ip address as you can see you can ping the server that means you can connect the domain again now let's connect the domain my computer properties same procedure authenticate click ok the welcome message will appear click ok 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 and restart the computer again Okay, now it is restarting. Preparing the network connections, applying the settings. First, once the system is restarted, click all control Dell. Select the domain petercrash.com. Enter username. Enter the correct password. and click okay now it will not show you any error because the security identifier has been changed as you can see we have successfully logged on loading the personal settings okay so now you can see we have successfully logged in as a client of that particular domain as you can see here is written such in Now let's go to my computer properties. As you can see, this is a member of the pirecrash.com. If you click all control del, you will see Sachin is logged on as a pirecrash slash Sachin. That means we have logged on into a server. Thank you for watching our this tutorial. In our next tutorial, will be very informative for you. So don't forget to. watch it for more information visit our website tech.pirakrash.com thank you